This video will show you how to use Laplace transform table for a simple inverse Laplace transform. Example 1.10, part 1. Find the inverse Laplace transform of 2 over s. We are going to use a table in this manner. Since we know Laplace transform of 1 is 1 over s and similarly Laplace transform of 2 is 2 over s therefore the inverse Laplace transform of 2 over s is 2 Part 2. Find the inverse Laplace transform of minus 5 over s. We look at the first formula in the table. We know that Laplace transform of 1 is 1 over s. Therefore, Laplace transform of minus 5 is negative 5 over s. That means the inverse Laplace transform of negative 5 over s is negative 5. Third example, find the inverse Laplace transform of 1 over s minus 3. From the table, we notice that Laplace transform of e power a t is 1 over s minus a. Over here, a is equal to 3. So, Laplace transform of e power 3t is 1 over s minus 3. So, the inverse Laplace transform of 1 over s minus 3 is equal to e power 3t. Example 4. Find the inverse Laplace transform of 5 over s squared plus 25. Now, we look at the fourth formula which say that Laplace transform of sine a t is equal to a over s square plus a square. Obviously our a must be 5 because Laplace transform of sine 5 t is equal to 5 over s square plus 5 square which is 25 here. Therefore, the inverse Laplace transform of 5 over s square plus 25 is equal to sine 5t. Example 5. Find the inverse Laplace transform of 24 over s power 5. Here, we shall look at the second formula. Here, because m plus 1 is equal to 5, so we must choose n equal to 4. That means Laplace transform of t power 4 is equal to 4 factorial over s power 4 plus 1, which is 5. But we know 4 factorial is 4 times 3 times 2 times 1, which is equal to 24. Therefore, the inverse Laplace transform of 24 
over s power 5 must be equal to t power 4. The sixth example, inverse Laplace transform of s square minus 1 over s square plus 1 square again. Here, we shall look at the second last formula, which say that Laplace transform of t cosine a t is equal to s square minus a square over s square plus a square then square again. Over here we observe that a must be equal to 1. That means Laplace transform of t cosine t is equal to s square minus 1 square which is 1 over s square plus 1 square again then square. Therefore reverse the process inverse Laplace transform of s square minus 1 over s square plus 1 square is equal to t cosine t. That finish the example.